Released in 1999, Silver is one of my favorite games. Hello everyone, my name is Andre. I usually stream this stuff, but due to a lack of webcam, I've decided to actually go back into Let's Playing, and um, I've actually done a run of this on my Twitch channel. Um, that would be twitch.tv slash 93 there'll be links in the description, potentially, if I remember to put them. Um, I've done a run of this in Portuguese, but I wanted to, to have something in English, so I've decided, with no webcam and nothing really prepared other than to play this game, let's start. As I was saying, Silver was released in 1999 for Windows and in 2000 for the Dreamcast and, I think, Mac OS, if I'm not mistaken, well, according to Wikipedia. Ooh, let's be silent for Lord Fuge, I'll explain later. It is decreed that all women of childbearing age will be taken before the Emperor's suit, so that he may choose a new wife. Any man or woman found impeding this order will be charged with treason and sentenced to immediate execution. Sounds fun. You abuse your power. This is a violation of our rights. What rights? You belong to the Emperor. He will do as he pleases. Guards, seize the women. So we have a thirsty Emperor looking for all the women in the village, in the country, in the world, wherever this takes place in. And apparently we need to adhere to that. Well, apparently not William. He didn't get the message. Mm. So here we have Fuge. Let's try that again. Here we have Fuge. He is the Emperor's right hand, or at least one of the right hands, as we'll find out later on. But there you go, there's your uh, premise of the whole game. Uh, thirsty Emperor wants all the wives, and somehow this is going to tie in with your story. And here's our main character. Grandad! <laughs> Are you in such a hurry to be beaten, Grandfather? Yes. Unfortunately, I'm constantly disappointed. But at least my student has confidence. Now, go into the house and get your blade. Amaze me with your swordsmanship. Yes. So, here's Silver. Well, uh, Silver the game, not the character. You'll get to the character eventually, but... Here's David. More importantly, David is our main character. This is our grandfather that goes by the name of Grandfather. And the way this game works, basically, it's an action RPG. So you'll see the combat and all that. But the most important thing that you need to know is that we'll have a menu that's divided in one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight parts. Uh, this will be your food where you have, well, uh, healing items all food items that uh, uh, will replenish your health. Here you'll have magic, which we will go into whenever we get close to it, but you don't need to worry about it right now. Here you have your ranged weapons, here you have your magic weapons, here you have your items. Within your items you have a map, you have your potions bag, because you also have potions. You have your key bag, and then you have your shield, your weapons, which for some reason already have a sword there, but I don't have a sword equipped in, uh, on me at the moment, or in my inventory. Uh, eventually you'll be able to see your, um, your inventory here as well. But then we have this one. This one is a special ability. I think it, the SP stands for special power, but I'm not entirely sure about that. But this is basically your special ability for which you can use um, in combat modes. I will show you all of that, no need to worry. In the meantime, do bear in mind that the white numbers will be your health and your blue numbers will be your magic points. However, I have chosen in the options to um, have the action bars always available. You can choose either to have them available uh, at any point or to have them only available during combat. I've decided to have that because I always like to, you know, monitor the health of my party members. Oh, I didn't hear you get up. I wanted, I wanted to, practice to practice with, with grandfather, grandfather. But, but you, you look, look so, so peaceful, peaceful. I, 
didn't want to wake you. Have you eaten? You'll need to keep healthy to have any chance of eating him. I will. Right, so this is Jennifer, our lovely wife. We can have, a, you know, another babble with her. We shouldn't need to worry about it. Basically, if you ever have the chance to speak to someone like this uh, in these situations where you're not really advancing the story that much, it's probably just filler text. Now, here we go. Now we have our sword. Now we have our shield. We're ready to go and train against Grandpa. Let's go, old man. Give me what you got. You can also see that the shield is represented by that purple um, health bar because the shield also has health. Hold your sword ready and never take your eyes off your opponent. We'll start with some basic moves that will ease you into combat. Go on. Now you try. Here's the whole thing about this. I'm playing on a PC and I'm using keyboard and mouse. What you need to do is use control to act as your um, key, as your uh, action key or your attack key, if that makes any sense, and then use the left uh, yeah, the left mouse button. There we go. I just want to make sure that I still remember how to play this game. The cool thing about this is that I'll let him talk. So we'll go through the tutorial because you can uh, do different attacks if you uh, hold the control key and then drag upwards, downwards, left and right. It'll be lovely. You'll see. Requires a little more skill than a lunge, but less accuracy. Stand fast, and in one swift move, swipe hard to your right. Like so this. Now we need to swipe to the right, and it means literally swiping to the right, not a perspective right from the character, literally the right of your plane, of your screen. Right, left, up, and down. It will be quite easy to get used to. It'll be the last thing they ever see. Yeah, 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 stop taunting. This is a very strategic move as well. Swiping left rather than right will make you swipe inwards, which is quite good. However, you'll see what's going to happen. So now we do the backwards swipe. Well, I think his animation got cut short for some reason. The backwards swipe just helps us, you know, move in uh, 180 degrees while still attacking our opponents. So it's not a bad idea to uh, control these. Goody goody. Now, with the right key, we can defend ourselves with the shield. Or, if we hold the, the, the right key, or if we just tap on it, we have a little dodge, like this. So here you go, we have a little training session with Grandfather. No real health is being lost. Oh god, that was quick. Jennifer was quite fast to show up. Oh Jesus. Yeah, blindside me, why won't you old man? Right, so as you can see, Jennifer is David's wife, and we have a thirsty emperor that wants to go, uh, wants to have a go at our wives. Hmm, gee, I wonder what's gonna happen. Oh, sorry, it's not huge, it's fuge. Don't you ever I should have dealt with you years ago. You're fortunate that I have more important matters to deal with. Your Emperor Silver requires a new wife. He may even choose this delicate creature. And then again, if my father isn't interested, I may take a voice. I would kill you first. Steady, lad. Listen to the old man. Your wife is such beauty. That gain so little pleasure from destroying it. Take her away. Take her away. Now I really like our grandfather's uh, expression of steady lad. Women are far too weak. Then the men who prey on them must be cowards. Why oh, aren't you the poet? <laughs> Guys, stay here and see that they get their wish. Right. 
So here's our first proper battle against these two grunts. As you can see, I'll be relying on the uh, forwards lunge a lot because it is indeed the um, uh, strongest swipe that we have at the moment. But yes, so you control your characters with your mouse, just like a 90s um, computer game. You control your characters with your mouse and you use control as your action key to then be able to attack your opponents. Um, one thing you might have now noticed, uh, well, you can only advance in the map after all the enemies have been um, killed, but also one thing you might have noticed is that uh, only our... Oh, sorry. He's just telling after them. Only our health bar is showing up and not our grandpa's uh, health bar. That's because he's not a controllable character. He uh, is controlled by AI and AI alone. This will not be the case forever. And for all characters, I should say. But I'll leave that for when that is. In the meantime, we have a, a pursuit to make for our wife. Oh, oh, Jesus. I'm doing quite well in keeping healthy with David, so I might as well carry on. Ah, oh, come off it. I was doing so well, I hadn't taken any, taken any damage yet. At least I have a spare wooden shield if mine breaks eventually. Um, yes, yeah, so the uh, representative health bars will have different uh, colors, but I'll shut up now. This time, but we will get her back. But don't worry. We'll help you all we can. Did you see or hear anything that may be useful? Do you know where they're headed? All the women were forced in the galleon. Fuse and some of his guards got into a smaller vessel. And both ships sailed off in different directions. Unfortunately, I don't know where either one is bound, sorry. Where are all the villagers? Or all the angry husbands? Some of the men have already banded together. They took their weapons and left in the direction of Haven. Will she be all right? They won't hurt her, will they? She's all we've got. I couldn't go with them. She'll be all right, love. She'll be all right. I have to say, for 1999, this voice acting is actually not half bad. Really, really like it. So, as the uh, old um, gentleman said, the uh, the elderly gentleman said, and that's what I meant to say, um, the uh, there is a group of men that uh, set camp on their way to Haven, and we can find that in our map. Where is it? Oh, this is not our map. This is our... Um, this is only our, our inventory. For some reason, I expected the inventory to have a bag. Now, here is the way we can save our game. This is the Chronicler. I am a chronicler. I shall record your adventures in my book of legends. Tell me of your deeds. And in all honesty, even though this means limited saves, I think... Uh, what am I going to call this? I'm going to call this YouTube. Even though this is uh, limiting our saves, it's really, really cool. A really cool way to explain how we are saving our progress. We have a chronicler that tells our story. So he's writing a book with our stories and with our adventures. So that's the way we know what we're doing. Now, I know this is a bit of a short episode. It's actually 14 minutes long, not that bad. But I think this is a very, very good way for me to stop this first episode of Silver. Um, I hope you've enjoyed it, and I'll be carrying on with uh, this lovely, lovely game. One of my favorites, as I said, Silver, 1999. So I'll see you tomorrow.